Texas victorious now joining us, one of the stars of the game, Joyner Holmes. Joyner, I'd love to know what Coach Aston said to you all at halftime, because you came out on fire in the second half, 13 of your 15 points in the second half. Mm -hmm. What was going on there? Um, I mean, at halftime, she just really was – she was really adamant about the guard play, like very, very adamant. And on the bench, as I was sitting for my two fouls, you know, um, she was like, she kept saying, do you guys realize that we have an advantage in the paint? And the guards kept saying yes. But when looking out there, it didn't seem like we actually realized it in the first half. And I think in the second half, we just took control. Like we took over the paint, like me, Jatari, and Charlie. I think we really gained our strength and our advantage within inside the paint. And I think our guards picked it up. I don't think in the first half our offense was flowing at all. That you guys probably saw. So I don't think we were. Yeah, we saw. I, think, I don't know. The guards were getting hacked and stuff. And we just got to realize how to get open and continue to run our offense when we're playing against Kansas. Well, power, credit to them. Their defense was very good tonight. Well, as you know, Nell's the most positive person in the world. And yeah. even she was getting frustrated <laughs> with you all early on. Okay, it's January 24th, and you're just now getting over here to the table. All right, that's a long time, man. <laughs> but I have to give it to I have to tell you this. You came out in that second half and really played well. Talk to me a little bit about that the drive from the high post and you're finishing with the left hand. That was sweet. Yeah, um, I've been trying to be working on that. Um, I need to work on my two feet. Um, my two feet need to plant in the ground so I can stop getting these fouls, these unnecessary fouls. But I think just trying to finish around the rim is what I've really focused on. And then I can make an outside presence as well. Once I start finishing around the rim, I can expand my game more. So I feel like just trying to do that and getting the flow of that will get me going. What players? step up when you have a first half like you did what players vocally step up in the locker room and try to get the team going um a lot of it was i would say me suge and a lot of LaShawn. LaShawn sees a lot so she's allowed she's able to talk and talk us through certain things and LaShawn sees a lot she's been here for a long time so i think she kind of knows the game better than a lot of us and so i think and me for Personally, because I was sitting on the bench in the first half, so I saw a lot, and I told my I told my guards what I saw and the post players as well. And I think we came out and executed really well in the second half. So, how do you feel your conditioning is right now? Because that is something that you're having to, to work your way back into. Um, I think I'm getting better game by game. I know Coach always says practice can only do so much, but game reps are really what we need. So I think I'm getting a lot of those, and I think I'm taking advantage of them. 32 points in the last two games combined. You feel like you're starting to find your rhythm offensively. I hope so, you know, I really do. I talked to Brooke today and Ariel today, and they've just been really in my ear about a lot of things. And so I think I'm just trying to follow what they left, the legacy behind that they left, and just keep on going. What do they say to you? What's their advice? Um, they just need, I need to be a presence. Like, I need to have a presence on the floor for us to win, you know? And I feel the same way. I mean, the last, like, four or five games before this, like, I don't feel like I had a presence at all in myself and in practice. And I think just... Like Charlie said last week, like everything we go through has to evolve in practice. We, we aren't going to get better in the game. There's no way we can flip a switch on and off. So I think just working hard in practice is what's keeping us going. Congratulations on the win. 15 points. <laughs> and Texas picks up victory. Number 16 on the season.